But they did a bait and switch on me. They Whoa. ambushed me. They never told me what this uh, documentary was really about. Mark Summers is sharing his side of the story. Two weeks after the release of the docu-series Quiet on Set, The Dark Side of Kids TV, which details allegations of sexual abuse and a toxic workplace at Nickelodeon, the former Kids Network host says he was misled about the true nature of the series. Revealing on Elvis Duran in the morning show April 5th that he was, quote, ambushed. I got called by these folks saying they wanted to do a documentary on Nickelodeon. And so I said, sure. And I went there and they asked me what I thought of Nick. And the first 10 or 12 seconds from what I understand this documentary are me saying all these wonderful things. But they did a bait and switch on me. They wow. ambushed me. Mark, who hosted Nickelodeon's hit children's game show Double Dare from 1986 to 1993, goes on to allege that the producers of the Investigation Discovery series weren't upfront with him. They never told me what this uh, documentary was really about. No way. And so they showed me a video of something that I couldn't believe was on Nickelodeon. And I said, well, let's stop tape right here. What are we doing? Well, we're doing this thing. Do you know this guy? And all this kind of stuff. And I left. The comedian who only appears in the first episode of the docu-series reflects on his time at Nickelodeon. However, after he's shown clips from Victorious, Zoe 101, and other shows run by Dan Schneider, viewer C. Mark appear to become confused. Sometimes I wonder if you can get juice from a potato. <sighs> Did that air on Nickelodeon? The 72-year-old goes on to explain to host Elvis Duran that he walked away from Quiet on Set after being told what it was really about, stating that he never met Dan or knew what was happening on his shows. However, the former Unwrapped host then reveals that producers told him he was going to be featured in the docuseries anyways. So I got a phone call about six weeks ago saying, you're totally out of the show, and I went, great. Then they called me about four weeks ago and said, well, you're in it, but you're only in the first part of it because you talked about the uh, positive stuff of Nickelodeon. What they didn't tell me and they lied to me about was the fact that they put in that other thing where they had the camera on me when they ambushed me. Quiet on set directors Mary Robertson and Emma Schwartz tell E! News in a statement, we are clear with each participant about the nature of our projects.